a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Matthew Bastard Matthew Bastard is a French rugby union centre who plays for Toulon. Stade de France. Bastard played for Crete rugby youth squads and then moved to Massy, where he fitted in well due to his bare mass. He went through the junior academy there and played for the third division club SU Massy. He attracted national attention, and after two seasons he moved to Stade de France. He was included in the 2009 Six Nations Championship squad. He impressed in the match against Wales, which France won 21-16. On 27 February 2009, this was his Six Nations Championship debut. He later played against England and as a replacement against Italy in the same competition. Matthew was involved in the 2010 Six Nations Championship and was a key figure for the French side. He scored two tries against Scotland, at Murrayfield. He was rested for the majority of the game against Italy, but was brought on for the last 15 minutes. R.C. Toulon In July 2011 Bastard was finally allowed to join Toulon. He had previously declared his wish to leave and, with Stade de France suffering major financial difficulties, his wish was eventually granted. He signed a three-year contract. In May 2013 he was named as man of the match as Toulon won the 2013 Heineken Cup final by 16-15 against Clermont Auvergne. Despite the presence of French international captain Guillaume Girardo in Toulon, Bastard was selected as captain for the 2017-18 season, with South African teammate Dwayne Vermeulen struggling with injury. After being caught swearing at opposition flanker Negrida Allegio in 2018, during a match against Benetton, Bastard was suspended for three weeks. 2009 New Zealand Tour Bastard was included in the French tour to New Zealand and Australia in June 2009, but returned to France early after sustaining facial injuries. He initially claimed that he had been assaulted from behind by four or five men outside his Wellington hotel as he was returning from a night out. The New Zealand police launched an investigation into the assault, and turned up security camera footage of Bastard returning uninjured to his hotel with four other people at 5.22 am that night, confirming the assault could not have taken place. Bastard subsequently stated that he had been drunk, and had sustained the injuries after tripping over a table in his hotel room, and that he had concocted the original story in order to avoid getting in trouble with team management. The incident proved to have diplomatic implications. Following the initial assault allegation, international media speculated on New Zealand's security and suitability as a tourist destination and host country, especially leading into the 2011 Rugby World Cup, spurring New Zealand Prime Minister John Key to issue an official apology for the incident. Following the later revelations, French Prime Minister Francois Fillon sent a letter to Key, in which he apologised for the unfortunate affair and spoke of the strong relationship between France and New Zealand, a rare official intervention in sporting issues for the French. Then on 29 June, L'Equipe reported that he had been admitted to a psychiatric facility after attempting suicide. Pierre Camus, president of the French Rugby Federation has referred the case to their disciplinary committee and asked them to investigate. In 2010, he was selected in the French Barbarian squad to play Tonga on 26 November. Bastard started his first test in two years in 2017 against New Zealand in a 38-18 loss. Bastard had not made it onto the international field since the 2015 World Cup where the French lost to New Zealand 62-13 in the quarter-final, as Bastard had struggled with form and injury since. Bastard will miss the opening round of the 2018 Six Nations Championship due to suspension. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries. Would you like to know more?